My name is David, and this is Ianda Sebro Paracord Design. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make the Ebb of Tides Paracord Bracelet. You'll need a four strand core setup with 5 8 inch buckle and about six feet of paracord times two. Whatever colors you choose, you want to run them side by side or however you set up a four strand core. All right, let's get into this tutorial. First thing you want to do is make sure you have two strands, both to the left and to the right, so that this will you require a four strand weave. All right, let's get started. First, what you want to do is you want to take your low cord, you want to, uh, I'm going to call these the low cords and these are the high cords. What you want to do, take your low cord over the four strands and bring up the uh, high, high strand up between one and two and three and four. You want to take this one up and you want to hold it like so. Then what you want to do is take your low cord and effectively make a uh, loop to one side. Then you want to take that cord and bring it down into uh, between one and two right here. And you want to hold off on that. Actually, you want to continue this through. What you want to do is take that, bring it back to the side that it originated from, and go up through that loop. After that, you want to take this cord, the one that came up between three and four, and you want to bring that back down through the same spot uh, ahead of the other cords. After that, you take that, you put a little slack right here, like this, on the uh, low cord that came through and back up through the loop. And you want to take that cord and you want to bring it through the loop that the low strand has made. Then you take that, you bring all the slack out of that one, and then you begin to tighten up the design. How you do this, you want to grab the this cord right here, and you tighten it up like so. Then you want to take the slack out of the other strand so that it closes it up like this. Then, as you're tightening it up, like it shows here, let me zoom in a little bit for you. Like that. Then, you want to tighten up all the slack right here, and then finish off by taking all the slack out of the cord that came over in between two and uh, three and four. Then you want to take the opposite and do the same thing for the other side. Starting off like so, bringing this one up, and doing the same thing. This is a little bit tricky in how it's made. So just bear with it and you'll get the desired effect.
pull all your slack out tighten it up as you go and then pull all the rest of the slack out and that's how you start it off I'm going to show you one more that way you get a feel for it. Next, what you want to do is the cords coming up through the top here, you want to bring those down so that the, the ones at the low end underneath can do the same process all over again. Then, this cord right here, this one right here, you want to take that up right in between three and four and repeat the process doing the same thing. You want to hold that up and create your side loop and then go down between one and two and then loop that back through repeating the process. Once you do that, you bring the one up from between three and four, back down again, through the same where you came through, and repeat the process. You wanna make sure that you always go through the originating cord around and back through, like you're looping on the cord coming over the top. Easiest way to tighten it up is to pull the slack out and then tighten it up as you go. Then push it up. Make sure you get all your slack out. Make sure it's all nice and tight. As you can see here. I will show one more side and then I'll end the tutorial with that. It does get a little difficult at times, so just take your time and it'll come out great. Put a little pressure on it and try and get the cords to line up with each other because over time it will uh, go away from that. And that's it. 
There you have it. The Ebb of Tides Paracord Bracelet. Thank you, and have a nice day.